As road cars become more sophisticated, and with the introduction of electric vehicles, low levels of NVH in passenger compartments becomes more and more important. The aim of the NVH250 system is to test an axle system before it meets the car body so that it saves time and money by not carrying through expensive NVH fixes into the production vehicle. Hi, I'm Ed. I'm uh, Chief Engineer at Electric Actuators at AB Dynamics. I have a 27 year background in Formula One and I also work for Formula E. Two OEMs approached ABD and asked them to design an axle level NVH machine and AB Dynamics identified that in order to do this really well it needed a, a ultra high performance electric linear actuator and uh, AB Dynamics approached me and we've worked together for four years now to produce a, an exceptionally high performance test system. Often axle systems are supplied to OEMs by companies which are defined as tier ones and the ability to communicate technically between these companies is highly important. They need to set standards so that they can deliver products that meet the correct specifications and they need to be able to measure these standards in order to be able to know that they're delivering a successful product. ANVH stands for Axle Level NVH Machine and NVH stands for Noise, Vibration and Harshness the noise and vibrations that you perceive as a passenger in that car. Customers have been fairly sensitive about road noise getting into the passenger compartment for, you know, for quite a long time. And the traditional way has been to, to solve this problem has been to make the prototype cars and then make the car quiet by adding components to the axle systems. But what tends to happen is that you, you carry a load of components into the production car, which you then have to pay for through the life of the car. The ANVH250 allows you to design your axle system before it meets the car body, so that you're left with a more optimal, complete design when the first prototype cars are built. The frame of the machine is designed to take a range of axles from light trucks all the way down to small cars, and a bespoke set of brackets are designed to fit the axle system in the correct place into the frame, and then precise motion is applied to the wheel mounting points in three orthogonal directions so that you can mimic the natural frequency input of the road and test how it will be transmitted through to the car body. Once you've mounted your suspension into the frame, the very high performance actuators and the auto-tune function in it makes testing you know, exceptionally easy uh, compared to sort of other previous systems. And AB Dynamics has many years of experience in, in automotive component testing and data capture. So the software environment gives a, you know, a very user-friendly uh, and easy system to use. And the dynamic arm, which is part of the SPMM 5000E system, can be integrated into the machine. So K and C measurement can be performed at axle level on the ANVH250 machine. The ANVH250 machine fits well into the future function of, of automotive design, getting subsystems functioning correctly early in the design stage and taking lower cost parts ultimately into the assembly of the vehicle.